what's going on guys welcome back welcome back i am in somewhat of a good mood i would say i'm ready to watch this but first we should remember the great one ragnar himself dying this season uh, it, it's unbelievable but it, it unbelievable but it's true um i never expected them to kill a character like ragnar i thought they would you know keep him around for you know wisdom for his sons at least you know they kill ragnar kill haslog which i'm not sad about it's just the way how it went about never really cared for her that much but the way how she went out was not ideal i did not expect them to use lagatha to kill her I, you know lagatha lagatha has always been the type of character that would show mercy in a situation like that so for her to kill her seems you know really a certain way like out of jealousy in a certain way i think you know what i'm saying um so i am not agreeing with the way that she took out athlog i think she could have let Asla go because really and truly it's not really her fault to be honest as I put some of this lotion on, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> anyway, that's um Yeah, so it's great what's going on right now. Everybody kinda knows as Odin, you know. I'm sorry I'm doing this, but I feel so ashy right now. <laughs> you have no idea I feel so ashy. My skin is feels just super dry. I have to put some lotion on. Anyways, um, but in any case, man, everybody has been informed through Ho Odin that came down to tell everybody, hey, Ragnar is dead. Well, you know, I guess to get the band back together, I'll, to get everybody together. So they could mourn him. I, I don't know. I don't know. Okay. I'm just speculating right now. Okay. So today I'm going to try to do two more episodes and then we'll do the other two to finish up the season. Okay. So let's go do this. Looking forward to what's going to come for King Egbert is still underestimating what is going on. What is his sons are going to what what his sons are going to do. Um, what are Ragnar's sons going to do to be specific? You know, what are they going to do? How are they going to go about this? So we'll see. Is Ivar going to go, you know, he already told Lagatha, I'm going to kill you. You kill my mom. <laughs> but we'll see how that turns out. And she she also got the prophecy that one of Ragnar's sons is going to kill him. So I'm going to kill her. So we'll see how that turns out. Anyways, man, let's go watch this. Let's go see what this is all about. See you guys for the review. All right. Wow. Two more episodes to go. What is going to happen next? Are they going over to freaking Wessex to go do this to, to freaking um, King Eckberg too? I, I don't even know. Yo, their army is huge, bro. <laughs> Yo, I was looking at at least, I want to say, on screen, it looked like about maybe about 500 to a thousand of them it's crazy the amount of them so i mean we've seen bigger armies don't get me wrong there's bigger armies of course there is but i'm just talking about those on screen how insanely big it looks you know what i'm saying so they little they showed up with like maybe a hundred people like i want to say maybe a hundred didn't even look like they brought a whole lot um, so they got overran. There was no need for them to show the battle there. There, that I can understand because we understood that that was going to be a wash. There was no way they were going to win that battle. So, um, so definitely that was a Vikings dub, hands down. We knew that. So I'm glad that they didn't show the battle and got to the aftermath. You know what I'm saying? I would have liked to see them get give Ragnar a proper burial. Didn't really see him down there. But, I mean, this is like, I want to say, it, it hasn't been that long since, since Ragnar died, right? I want to say maybe a week, maybe less. You know what I'm saying? So, 
there's no way yes you know he's dead but then again you know what i'm saying i don't think his flesh is rotting yet that's what i'm trying to say so they could take him out and give him a proper viking burial you know with the fire and everything i think i think you know <laughs> you know it also confirms that ragnar has a serious connection with the gods you know because one thing ragnar never did he never denounced the gods like he he, he just questioned you get what i'm saying he, he just questioned which is what we all are supposed to do we are supposed to question is there the ultimate being or you know what i'm saying like that's what we all are supposed to do is to question these you can't just let people tell you hey there's a god and you should serve him no question it question it know for yourself know for yourself you are as an individual should know for yourself don't let somebody tell you oh there's a god and just run towards it and be like okay i guess there is a god i'm gonna serve him blah 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 no 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 that's not how it works i don't believe in that because that's how that's what religion is that's what religion is and i hate religion so Thank you guys so much for tuning in, as always, man. But I don't know what's going to happen next. They're going to go over to King, King Edbert and do the same thing. Rolo, I'm not, I don't like Rolo. I, I, I don't like Rolo. I don't think I'll ever like him again in, in the series. I think, um, I don't think I'll ever, uh, you know, I forgave him once. And then he went back and did the same shit. You know what I'm saying? I gave him a pass the last time when he went against Ragnar. I gave him a pass and I was like, okay, he's learned, he recuperated, you know what I'm saying? He realized that his life was saved and blah, 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 blah. And he became one of my favorite characters again. And then he betrayed him again. Like, no, you don't get a third time to do this shit again. No, go about your business with your wife and your Frankia people, you know. And also, man, um, what else? Bjorn and Astrid doing stuff. That's that's okay. I, I don't have I don't have a problem with it because of the way how Vikings move. You know what I'm saying? Um nobody ever really belonged to, and, and that's the thing too. Like that's why um Ragnar's and Lagatha relationship is so was so good or so different from from other from other relationships, you know what I'm saying? Um and I think that was the only true, genuine relationship that ever happened in the show. Um, I mean, you could make the argument for Floki and Helga, too, um, you know, of being a very pure relationship that doesn't have any outside thing. One of the things that I, you, you know, um, like with them, they, they, you know, they can invite slaves in their bed and stuff like that. If your husband and wife, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Um, if the husband decides that they're going to take somebody else or whatever, like the wife can't have an issue with it and, and shit like that. But Lagatha always had a problem with anybody that Ragnar would try to mess with or whatever the situation is. She always had an issue with it. You know, so I'm digging it. I'm digging it. You know what I'm saying I'm digging it. I'm curious to know how this season is going to end. Then we can move on to season five. I know that season six is airing right now. I know, but we're not there yet. We still got to go through another season before we catch up, but we should catch up before they drop season seven for sure. So ongoing season six, I don't think we're going to get through season five in time before season six is completely through, but, um, we're getting there. We're catching up. We're catching up. So if there is a season seven, we're definitely going to be there for premiere um, at the end of this year. So um, we should be able to get through five and six before season seven drops at the end of the years at some point. Or I don't know if it's next year or if they decide to continue the series. I, I no nobody. I'm, I didn't hear that Viking is going to fit like season six is the final season. Like I didn't hear that. Um, so I'm guessing there is going to be a season seven. So we'll see. We'll see. You know, we're looking forward to what's going to happen. So, um, definitely, man, some interesting things happened during these two episodes that I, that, you know, the situation with King Harold 
um, him getting his heart broken, basically. But they're still planning something. So I'm keeping an eye on them because I think they're planning to overthrow Kattegat. And I think they're the ones that's probably going to end up killing Lagatha, if anything. Um, but, you know, we'll see. And that's going to turn everything upside down with, um, you know, with Bjorn and stuff like that. We'll see how things go. I don't know why Bjorn is so mad. Is he just mad because Ragnar died? Because he's so out of character what he, you know what I'm saying? I think he's he's mad and he's trying to figure out an outlet because he doesn't want to weep per se. And I think that's what's really driving that anger. I think is the fact that Ragnar, Ragnar died and you know what I'm saying? He had to come home and go deal with this shit now. You know what I'm saying? And get the revenge and stuff like that. And he, listen, I am in no disagreement with him about what he was saying to them before they left. It's like, Ivar is not fit, to, he's not fit to lead. Yeah, he can advise because he was there, but he, but still Bjorn, he's the one that should be leading them. He's been in battles, he has battle experience, like you can't, that stuff you don't, you can't buy. You get what I'm saying? The kind of leadership that he's learned over the years by being with his dad, being with people like Floki and even Rolo, that, that's the kind of experience you just can't buy. You get what I'm saying? So I think they should listen to, to, to Bjorn. Never disagreed with him with what he was saying. It's just that he was just angry. <laughs> like the way how he was saying things was just way off. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like it was, the, the shouting was unwarranted. He could have said the exact same thing without being without shouting so much you know what i'm saying so that's weird the prop that's the only problem i had with what he was saying but anyways he got his point across regardless he's the leader blah 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 but in a way in the last scene i'm wondering if he's disgusted by what he did to king ella because everybody else was smiling and he was just like you know what i'm saying like do I really want to be doing this? You get what I'm saying? Like, that's how what his face was telling me. But I could be wrong. I could be wrong. But we are looking forward to some more Vikings. Two more episodes to go. I will try and drop those sometime this week. So look out for that. Anyways, thank you guys so much. Love you guys, man. You guys are unbelievable. Thank you guys so much. Leave a like. Leave a comment. Subscribe if you're new. We out here. Skull.